what do we do? Yeah, yeah. When it feels like we've been lost for days and your life is stuck inside a maze, yeah, we'll make it through. Yeah, yeah. But it feels like we've been stuck in time, trying to find myself, not lose my mind. Check, yo, uh. Track of time, well it seems that we've lost it You're sick and you're tired and I'm ill and exhausted There is a line and I think that you crossed it You tried to catch my drift but I don't think that I tossed it Uh, yeah, they don't get me like you do Work through the pain cause it's business as usual This is the love that we need to protect in the end I just hope you don't forget I'll be there if ever you fall I'll pick up if ever you call I'll be there if ever you need Promise you that I won't leave I'll be there if ever you fall I'll pick up if ever you call I'll be there if ever you need Promise you that I won't leave No, no Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Fakun2002 here and in this video I'm showing you guys a new easier method to do the god mode glitch in Zombies in Spaceland. This is extremely easy and the best part is that this can be done solo and this works on both consoles and works on both maps, Zombies in Spaceland and Raven of Redwoods. But I recommend you guys do these god mode glitches while you can before they do get patched because what I notice with these god mode glitches is that these god mode glitches make you immune. I mean, our past god mode glitches have not made us immune to the boss fight, but this one makes you immune to everything, all the traps and the boss fight, like I said. So I recommend you guys do this glitch while you can before it does get patched. But anyway, guys, with the glitch, you're going to need to get 25 tickets. doesn't matter how you get them, but you're going to need to get 25 tickets. And you're going to be going and acquiring the rewind grenade, which can be found at any kind of ticket booth standbys around the map. And second, you're going to need to kill some zombies, because what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to have one of the zombies to drop a pair of glasses. I know it sounds ridiculous, but this is for a god mode glitch. So you're going to need to have a zombie drop a pair of glasses. As you see here, it drops a pair of glasses. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to be going up to the pair of glasses. And then whenever it does say hold X or square to pick up the part, you're going to be holding X or square and a millisecond after you do hold X or square. Use that rewind grenade and if you got the timing right, you guys should see press L1 or LB to toggle the shades. Now, if you got that message on your screen and you have been rewinded back, then you officially have done God Mode. It's that simple. It's a very, very simple glitch. You can be doing this on like round three because I believe I got the shades on that round, but I didn't get the rewind grenade, so... You can be doing this on a very early round, it's very very simple, and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And a little tip while you're doing this glitch, you can go into the alligator's mouth, and you will not die at all, like I said, you are immune to everything in this glitch. So please take advantage of this glitch while you can, before it does get patched, so you can complete the easter egg for both Raven of Redwoods and Spaceland, if you can't do it with any kind of sort of god mode, well here you guys go, here's a kind of god mode you can use while you're doing the easter egg. You guys must be asking, can I do this with a friend in my game? Yes, you can. You do not have to do this solo. You can do it with your friends and whatnot, but yeah, guys, that's basically gonna be it. I know the brute can spawn in while you're doing this little unlimited alligator kind of trap thing or uh, strategy to get into the high rounds. I know the brute can spawn in, but the thing is is that you cannot kill the brute with the alligator trap, so you're gonna have to physically actually kill it yourself with your weapon. That's the only bad thing, and I would not consider this an unlimited rounds glitch, but I would consider it a very good strategy to get into the high rounds. But yeah, guys, that's basically it. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed, and subscribe to watch the best glitches coming from my channel. Other than that, guys, for Kunst2002, signing out.